Not the worst. Okay. Let's go ahead and continue and uh, see where it goes. I think last we left off, um, the Doomsday Heist just uh, finished, or Raid, Doomsday Heist. Uh, Doomsday Raid just finished in the club. Um, Good evening, sir. Were you we got some information and sir, I forget what our next stop was. One sec, I think Cut my... yourself down. Yeah, I think keeps going over to my other monitor. I need there to work go. in silence. Sir, if I may say something. Uh... Okay. Wait, where'd he go? One sec. Where's he at? Okay. Your situation is without a doubt far from happy, but it shouldn't lead you to suicidal thoughts. What would you know about that? You're not alive. That's not very nice, Richard. What? Am I hurting your feelings? I am registering that you're angry, sir, but you shouldn't take it out on me. Oh, really? Why not? Didn't you say you belong to us? Everything here belongs to me, you get me? If I want, I can make scrap out of you. I could hack you up with an axe and not even pay a fine. Who's gonna stop me? Of course, sir. But that wouldn't be very human. Oh, yes, my friend. It would be all too human. Richard is an angry man. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's me. It's it. Just wanted to oh, see if you're still alive. Zowski. I'm fine, but Phil. Yeah, I know. Poor guy. But it's fine. <coughs> it's fine. This is war, Richard. Losses are part of the game. What were they doing in Doomsday? They're nervous because of our campaign. Did you contact him already? Newman? No. Then do it. You can access the database near Cloud Hub now. I'm still not entirely sure how. Tell Adam he needs to look for data fragments. Uh, okay. I've already uploaded some for him. They're encrypted. Uh, Only he can see them. That's so why they showed up he needs in front to of find him. them and send them to your cloud hub. Begin with a keyword. When you find a fragment, upload it. Keep going until until you have some remnant of intact memories we can use. And if he doesn't believe me, improvise. You know him better than he does. I'll call you back. Hardly. But you'll be hearing from me. Okay. So we should be able to use the computer then. My mentor. Contact him. Fine. Data fragments, keywords. How am I supposed to understand this? Hive call. Newman, Adam. That must be him. Gonna be like, oh my god, it is me. Newman person picks up now. So he is a real person, <clears throat> but he is a copy of himself. Adam is a copy of Cloud this guy, Richard. Welcome. This contact is currently offline. Please hold. Closing cloud call. This contact. Hive call service. Connection failed. This contact is currently offline. It's trying to stop them. Hold. My name is Richard Nolan. I'm calling from Berlin. From where? What kind of connection is this? It's not so easy to explain. The connection is improvised. You mean illegal, right? Listen to me, Adam. This is important. I'm calling because I have reason to believe that... Yeah? 
guess. That... that you are a part of me. What? Uh, let me explain. No. Please, don't explain anything. Adam, please. I feel like that was a very bad way to introduce yourself. Hey. Hi, Lydia. Hey. <coughs> What's up? Nothing, nothing. I just wanted to hear your voice. Okay, you've heard it now. Am I disturbing you? Is Tracy there? No, Tracy is not here. But I'm still disturbing you. Let's not start this again, okay? How long do you think I'm going to play this game, Richard? Lydia, listen. I really have to go. Let's talk later, okay? You wanted to talk to Tracy months ago. I have to go now, Lydia. Closing cloud call. <sighs> what am I doing? Face to face. I have to talk to Adam again. Okay. Um. Can we call him? It's me again. I can see that. I'm blocking this frequency now. Adam, please don't hang up. Did you receive anything? Some kind of data? Data? Data fragments, uh, virtual constructs. I know it. Wait. That thing in my apartment, that's. that's yours? This, um. I don't know, hologram. That must be it. Well, just get it out of my wife's study. Send Only it to you me. can see it. How can I? It's data. Send it to my cloud address. I'll decrypt it and send it back to you. What? No, w why? So you can take a look at it. At your data? <laughs> I don't even know you. Yes, Adam, you do. You know me better than... Okay, look. There has to be some kind of misunderstanding, sir. I'm gonna send you back your stuff now, and that's it. Goodbye. Oh, boy. A conflict. Hey, SK Gaming, thank you for the what lurk, love. Appreciate it. Well, let's see. All right, so we now we're in uh, study. You have two new messages. Adams, see his message. Adam, please give me. A I have to talk to you. Adam, Uncle Jeremy is coming out of his cryo sleep. We're all meeting at the Wilsons. Family is important, Adam. Okay, I'll stop. Hmm. <laughs> All right, so let's get that fragment. Here it is. Whoa. What? Okay, that was interesting. Right. What now? Send it from where? My cloud hub. Where is his? Right here. Send it to me. Hmm. Let's see. Warning. The version number of this object is obsolete. Hmm. Scan oh, well. complete. Object ID recognized. Oh. Object sent successfully. Well, that's really easy. Send. Cloud Hub prompt. You have new data from unknown. Adam, finally. Let's see. This data is 18 years old. How far back does 18 this database go? 18 years old, jeez. Sector 36, Berlin. The doomsday, perhaps? Okay. Decode fragment. Oh, it's one of these again. It has to be one of the other room. No, it has to be one of the other room. No, it has to be one of the other rooms. Okay. Wrong room. Wrong room. Wrong room. It's the one with all the people. That's Almost got it. 
Okay, it's that one. Okay, that looks better. That's what's that? There. I should upload it immediately. Okay. It's like a back alley somewhere. Unknown has sent you new data. Hold on one sec. So I'm back. Uh, not sure, exactly sure what just happened there, but right when I went to go click on my stream deck to change it back, uh, it just completely shut off, which is odd. Your cloud hub. I don't know what's going on with that. Did send me data. It's like flashing now too, which is weird. The 2030. It's 10 years from now. Almost. Almost 10 years. Now. What's that? Where? Ow! Get going! Go! Jerk! You're completely off your head. Look at you. This will have consequences. Mm, sure. Go home. Sleep it off. That's incredible. Hey, open up! I've lost something! Open oh wait, that's up, Tracy. You idiots! It's important! Important? What's important? Who is that? Hello? Can you hear me? Oh, they've probably thrown it in the trash. Probably not. It's weird, my stream deck is now Still flashing. Here. If I were you, I'd get out of here. You don't want to be hanging around here as a woman at this time of night. Especially not in your state. But leave me alone. I'm looking for something. Not here, you're not. Dumpster. Hey, darling. You all alone here? Ugh. Hey, I asked you something. Leave me alone. Why don't you come here? Oh, get lost. There's that Richard. Is this is how they met. On, honey? Oh, well, I, oh, God. I lost something. I heard. You were making a lot of noise about it. Something important? Well, for me it is. It's 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 a lucky charm. Hey, could I take a photo of you? You have a wonderful face, full of anguish. Beautiful. Don't worry, don't worry. I'm a scan photographer at Kurt's Labs. Here's my card. So if you want, uh... Thanks, but I really gotta go. You should go home, honey. It's dangerous around here when the club closes. Uh, excuse me? What's up? I need help. That looks like a very pointy jacket. Yeah, I, I think they put it in the garbage back there. And that old guy creeps you out. Got it. You know him? He hangs around here a bit, looks for scrap. He's mostly harmless. Uh huh. Mostly. Could 
Would you... Would you... Have a word with him? <laughs> of course. That would be great. Come with me. Let's go over together. He looks younger. Hey, enough for today, okay? Get lost, man. I'm busy. The lady here is looking for something. The lady should take care of her sweet neck. Everything here belongs to me. You want me to call the cops? You think I'm afraid of them? We could try and find out. Hey! All right. All right. Oh, finally. Such a creep. Thanks for helping me out. Not a problem. Should I help you look for it? What is it exactly? Mm, my lucky charm? It's a... a music box. That's what you heard. <laughs> what, what's so hey, funny? Sure you carry a music box around with you. <laughs> That's really touching. Listen, thanks again. I'll be fine alone. Hey, I didn't mean to offend you. No, no, it's all fine. Okay. Can I do anything else? No. It's an important music box, isn't it? I need it. It's definitely in here. Oh, damn it! Where is it? A cloud call? Oh no. Dad. What does he want now? There! There it is! Oh, thank God! Ah, you can open it. I see. It's really important. But well, what's it got to do with you? You're right. I'm sorry. Hey, you think I could ask you out for a drink? My treat? That's nice, but I have to make a cloud call now. It's all right. So I, I guess this is back when they didn't have it blocked off. Don't worry, I don't have a lot to tell you. How's mom? Is everything okay? When's she getting out of the hospital? She got out three weeks ago, Tracy. Oh, what? Really? Why didn't you tell me? I did tell you. We already talked about it. Did we? But when was that? I can't remember. Listen, Tracy, you're completely wasted. That stuff is ruining your life. Uh, don't start with this again. Your mother and I talked about it yesterday. We're both of the opinion that if you want to fall, then we'll let you. All the way. You won't wake up till you hit rock bottom. What's that supposed to mean? We've decided not to help you anymore, Tracy. What? You're not going to hear from us. And we don't want you to call. You'll receive no support and no money. Daddy, you can't be serious. Don't interrupt me. Do a detox. Get a job. Take responsibility yourself. Then and only then can you contact us. Not before then, you understand? Are you guys crazy? You want to just cut me off entirely? Take care of yourself, okay? Daddy? <sighs> <laughs> Oof. Twenty thirty-three. What? What? Now it's three years later. <laughs> Tracy. Look this way, please. Fantastic, thanks. Where am I now? A couple of questions, Tracy. Just quick, our readers love you. Okay, I have a couple minutes. But nothing personal, okay? And no politics. <laughs> <laughs> How does it feel to be The Voice's new station avatar? How was the scan? I feel honored, of course, and it's wonderful to see your own image everywhere. But your avatar won't age. Doesn't that make you jealous? What? <laughs> Next question, Such a weird please. question. Tracy, the voice Boston here. There's one question we keep hearing in our feed. How do you stay so fit? What's your secret? Sleep a lot, I meditate, I don't have a formula. I'm just trying to be myself. Everything else is out of my control. And do you manage it? What do you mean? To stay yourself, to keep under control. Or do you use other ways to find yourself? Uh, what are you getting at? For example, Drugs. say, substances. Ah, 
Well, I drink herbal tea. That helps a lot. Next question? Just herbal tea. Are you certain? You don't put anything else in there? I've answered your question. Someone else? Ted Beasley, the Guardian. Miss Dawson, you were in Moscow last autumn. No political questions, please. You, back there. There are rumors that your parents have... Excuse me. Miss Dawson will not take any more questions regarding her private life. What? What about my parents? Your parents have been rumored to have cut off all contact with you. Why? Evade, deny, or admit. Uh... Admit it. Well, my parents are having difficulties. I mean, of course. They are sometimes concerned when they read about all this stuff in the cloud. Does your fight with your parents have something to do with your nightlife? Next question, please. What would you say to people that have claimed you're a junkie? I don't talk with such people. Back to Moscow, Ms. Dawson. As I said, no politics. Interview over. Do you take drugs, Tracy? Time's up. Thank you, everybody. Tracy. You're really what trying to get her into fine. her head. My bag. I just need to get my bag. Maybe you left it at the coat check. Hurry up. Must be some kind of VR. But what does all of this have to do with Where's me? Where's the... I'm assuming the coat check's back here? Oh yeah, it is. It's a never-ending co check. Why is she holding your stomach now? Hey, are you okay? You, you look kind of worried. Yeah, you look a little pale. This guy is in uh, Richard's context. I need to get my stuff back. Can I get you a drink? Walter, cut it out, okay? You're too old for this. Let me take care of the lady. I apologize. Sometimes my colleague overestimates himself. Oh, -ho. come on, Walter. You have to write in my edits, don't you? Oh, fine. We'll see who's overestimating who. Good. Now we're rid of him. Uh, that wasn't very nice. Ah, uh, it's Walter. He can handle it. But he's right. You look pale and you're shaking. Can I help you? My bag. My bag is gone. It was just here. It was lying on the table. What does it look like? Like a bag. Black with a gold lock. Was there something valuable in it? Hmm. It's not in here. It must be somewhere else. Not in here. Um...
Tracy, I believe this belongs to you. Yes. Oh, thank God. O where was it? Uh, my assistant found it. It was lying upturned on the floor. Tracy, Wait, that's Dr. Kurtz. This is Dr. Kurtz, director of Kurtz Institutes. Tracy, I'd like to talk to you alone for a minute. Excuse me, but we were just... I didn't ask you. I asked Tracy. Hey, hey, wait a minute. Don't take that tone with me. But it's exactly the tone you deserve. I don't believe you know who I am. I do, actually. And I believe your boss is waiting for you. Richard, can you come here, please? This is a joke, right? No! Fine, okay. Tracy, I have to go. Maybe we'll see each other again later? Richard! Coming, coming. Oh, sorry, we have to go. I've arranged for your Sky Whale to wait. What uh, can I do for you? I've been observing you for a while, Tracy. That's weird. You were wonderful. Perfect. I have some interesting work for you. What is the work, sir? You mind if I turn your bot off for just a second? How did you do that? I know the kill switch frequencies. I designed this model. Tracy, I'd like to have you on board for a project. A genetic exploration. Uh, you need not worry, it's completely safe. And you would be doing science a big favor. Is it well Oh boy. Made? I wouldn't worry about that. Come visit me at Kurt's Labs. I will tell you all the details. Uh, let me consider it, okay? I'll call you. Do. Do. Oh, we are late. We have to go, Tracy. Okay, I have to go. See you soon. Okay. Okay. That's a good amount of information. What the hell was that? Hello. Adam. Thank God. So, can we talk now? Yes. I have a couple of questions. Sure, sure. About that data you sent me. Yeah? Was that you? Yes. Did you? Yes, that's right. It's a, a piece of data from my life. Why can I experience it? How did you do that? I have access to a database, but the data is encrypted and virtual. The data can only be played virtually where you are. <laughs> okay. Uh. Where are you, did you say? In Berlin. Berlin. In reality, the physical world. Uh, I don't know a Berlin. Is that like a VR or something? It's reality. What? Your city is a VR. <laughs> My city isn't real. You're not real. Okay. That is insane. I'm hanging up. Adam, you have a family, right? Just like me. Yes. And I have to take care of them. John, my son, he isn't doing too well. That's terrible. What's wrong? He has to go to a clinic every day. Is he sick? He's upset. I had a cab accident, and his mother isn't here. She's working. A cab? What happened? I don't remember. Like I said, an accident. You didn't have an accident, Adam. These are echoes from my memory. They've probably been modified. I had an accident. You understand? It was horrible. Tracy, she... She was with me in the car. Tracy? My wife. Does the name mean nothing to you? My wife is called Amy. But... There was a Tracy uh, in the in that, thing that he just did. You saw Tracy? Where? When? Talk to me, Adam. Tell me everything. Did Tracy say anything? Did you notice anything? Kurtz. Dr. Kurtz. In a wheelchair? Raymond Kurtz, yeah. And? What does he have to do with Tracy? Tracy and Kurtz were talking. He wanted her for a project. A genetic study. A genetic study? Nothing else? No. Look around. There has to be another data set somewhere. Listen, I don't think... Send it to me. The more fragments you see, the better. Sorry. I have to go now. Who were you talking to? What? Oh, just a hive call. 
It was... Guy called Richer and Lawyer. Uh... I don't know. Some guy called Richard. Were you mad at him? Mad? No. Just a difficult guy. Hmm. They wear their pins so high up. <laughs> Interesting. Perhaps. Maybe Walter isn't that crazy after all. And switch between Richard and Adam. Okay, sweet. You have new cloud messages. So now what? Hey Richard, it's me, Jenny. Call me back. Do you know what, Richard? Screw you. Have a nice life with your model. Wait, what? No new cloud messages. Richard, this is not funny, okay? Pick up now. Richard, are you come up. Did something call me? Do you know what, Richard? Screw you. Have a nice. Why is she so angry? Hey, Richard, it's me. Call me back. Okay. okay. Give her a call. And for. Hey, Jenny. Thanks for the message. Here I am. Richard, thanks for calling me. Listen, I'm getting worried now. Have you heard anything at all? Nothing. Steve is helping out. I'm very thankful. Yeah. Listen, Richard, I wanted to apologize. I wasn't very nice to you on Sunday. It's okay. Neither was I. It was all a bit too much for me. I was pretty exhausted. So are you doing any better? Health-wise, I mean. I think it's going to take a while. My memory, you know, a lot has come back to me, but there are also things... I might go back to the doctor again. Hey, can I ask you something, Richard? Something personal? Sure. Do you love Tracy? Well, what kind of a question is that? You know us, Jenny. We have James. We're a family. No, that's not what I mean. Of course I love her. How could you think... Wait a second. Are you in contact with Tracy? Is this her idea? <laughs> what? She wants you to feel me out. That's what's going on. No? What for? What do I know? Maybe she wants to know if it's worth coming back to me. Or maybe she wants revenge. Just wants to make me suffer. Richard! Or she probably wants you to oversee the breakup. Tell me she's leaving me in stages. Hey, are you completely insane? You're in this together. You're not calling because you care about me. <laughs> okay, Richard, this is just too stupid for me now. Oh, yeah, for me too. <laughs> you really need to see a doctor. Let me know when you're feeling better. All right, so Richard is very accusing. Who gives Steve a call? Or Hi, Steve. And Steve, if he had any in for information. Did you clear up your expiration? More or less. What about that man in my apartment? Did you make progress with a database? Okay, Richard. Listen to me. I, I don't know if it'll help you now, but. I put his movement profile into MoveScan. Who is it? I don't know. Yet for some reason, this database is coming up with more than one match. I thought movement profiles were unique, like fingerprints. Well, if you ask me, this whole MoveScan stuff doesn't work. Can we meet up? I know you have a lot on your plate, but I have to know if you found anything out about the man Tracy was with. Uh, yeah, sure. I'm at the office. All right, so I guess we'll go uh, meet him at the office then, and then go from there. Oh, nice! It automatically took us here. Then run upstairs. Help our authorities fight illness and disease. Help our authorities fight illness. Work.
<laughs> I'm still so confused with the word voice. It doesn't really look like that's actually how it's spelled, but apparently it is. Apparently this place has a lot of uh, history too. Yes, I I think I have some real problems. Actually, buddy, I knew that already. Hey, Richard, can't stay away, huh? Hey, Richard, listen to me. I want to talk to you. Okay. Not here, though. Come with me. Sure. He's acting weird. Something's definitely up with him. Or he talked to his wife, and his wife was like, He accused me of blah 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 blah. He's gonna be like, listen, I'm not gonna help you anymore. Is this about Jennifer? If you know already, why didn't you come to me? Wait, what? Well, I thought time heals all wounds anyway, right? <laughs> You snap at my wife, blame her and accuse her with crazy conspiracy theories, and, and then you think you can just sit and, and wait it out? Yeah, I don't know that's what how I figured. It's all a bit much for me at the moment. You can't imagine what I... I don't care about all that. Whatever happened to you, it's no excuse for attacking your friends. You don't have that many. Now, if you keep going on like this, you'll have even fewer. Steve, I'm sorry, okay? Don't tell me. Tell Jenny. What about the research? Will you still help me? Steve, please. You have no idea what I... Yeah, j just cut it out. You had an accident. Yes, I get it. But you also had a life before your damned accident. You try to get it back in order. That's exactly what I'm trying. Listen. I will help you. But I'm doing it for your family. For Tracy and the kid. Okay? Okay. Good. Come with me. Come on, I'm with me again. Let's find your family. What? What did he find now? Like stuttering too. Oh boy. Where's it gonna go next? All right, so we're back at the office. Okay, Steve. Are these the move scan results? You know we can both go to jail for this, right? Let's start with the best matches. Eighty-four point three. Philip Osang. Jack Oster, eighty-two percent. Wait, slow down. We should look at the profiles one by one. Yomez. 99.6. percent Might be it. He's 99.7. Curtis. Girl. Peter. Wait, Best wait. match so far. Christos something. 89.6. Frank Thomas. 82.2%. I think it's this guy. What's his name? Uh, One. Wait, actually. One. Oh wait, he's deceased. Never mind. Oster Jack or Curtis Peters? Pe yeah, Curtis Peter. <laughs> All right. Um. Christos. This. This is something. 
meter. All right. Okay. Now we only need the cloud contact. Curtis Peter, no, not found. Hmm. Though it can't Have be. A look at that. Who is the other one? I'll stir Jack. Maybe it's better to start with the movement profiles. Where's Jack at? Frank Thomas. Buster Jack. Then. Yep, he's on all these. Okay, this doesn't all fit. What? Okay, again. So that one's right. He doesn't say anything. Known aliases White Stanley. Wait, so do they want me to sign these first? Like that. And this guy. No, start again. Wait. Slow down. I'm missing something. We should look at the profiles one by one. Yeah, I was looking at the profiles one by one. Look at this. That can't be right. So this, this is something. <laughs> this is one. Whoops. Wait. Slow down. We should look at the profiles one by one. Have a look at that. Wait, what? There. That's a hit. Stanley White. Does he have a profile? Oh, okay, I see. Cloud contact and everything. He's from here, see? It's his known okay. alias, okay. not actually him. He looks different to the man in the video. Yeah. Strange. I'll still call him, though. Something else, Steve. Do you have any material regarding Kurt's labs in the archives? Don't tell me you're starting with that, too. I just want to check something. Sure. That's what Walter said. All that stuff is with him. Has been for ages. I see. I had no idea what he... what he's been doing since he... went solo. I wonder why that was. I should talk to him again. Be a hand in the phone. Sticking out from the, the blankets. Wait, was I supposed to leave? Only I was supposed to leave. Hired floofer. with suitable measures he also announced is it Frank that I talked to that's our old desk wait there are boxes of stuff right there mr. Nolan is now a good time Troy Davis, I've been supporting the team over the past week. I heard. Congratulations. I am a big fan of your column. Really? Well, thanks. Are you feeling better now? Pardon? Oh, your colleague said that you had an accident. Yeah, I'm okay. How long have you been working as a journalist? 
Oh, well, not that. Uh, uh, this is my first job. I'm so glad that Frank offered it to me. I promise you that your work is safe in my hands. I'm sure it will be. Well then, I have to get to work. In case we don't see each other again. Oh no, we will. Okay. I don't know what it is, but sort of a little bit of the world reminds me of uh, not Star Wars, um, the other game. Hey, Walter. DC Universe may Online. I, may I interrupt you for a second? No. Hi, Richard. What are you doing now? Researching. Going crazy. What about? <laughs> you wouldn't understand. Try me. Come on, Richard, stop it. We haven't worked together in an age. Do you know the last time you were in this office? It's been a while, I know. Four years. That long already? Four <laughs> years, please. You know, at some point, I just couldn't muster the courage to walk in here. I thought you were angry at me. You did. Yes. Because... Because I left you hanging. Oh, stop talking crap, Richard. Frank put me out the pasture, and you... You had more important things to do. That's not true, and you know it. Uh, can we not... Whatever. But why are you here? Small talk? If you like. How's Tracy? Uh, what's the kid up to? How's your career? Walter, please. What? Are we doing small talk or not? Tracy and James have disappeared. I'm looking for them. Hmm. I thought so. What do you mean you thought so? What? Forget it. You know I'm a bit mad. Everybody does. Yeah, why is he sitting under the table? I need your help, Walter. <laughs> Go ask Frank. He'll help you, I'm sure. He fired me. Really? Well, Richard, that's how it is. Everybody's time comes. Walter, listen. You've done research on Kurt's labs in the past, haven't you? <laughs> I have. Do you still have the files? Well, you're too late. There are things in motion that can't be stopped anymore. I don't get it. What, what things? You know, Richard, I've been doing a lot of thinking these past years. I used to think life was about finding the truth or getting justice or whatever. It's not? No, it's about life. Life and living. You just... Gotta be on the correct side. Uh-huh. And what is the correct side? We're all mortal. Sooner or later we all die. And then what? A gravestone, a bunch of paperwork, some data. Okay, and? Well, there are always two sides to every story, here and beyond. Life and death. One and zero. A binary system, you understand? Actually, not at all. <laughs> you will. You're just taking your first steps. Frank's right. You're actually insane. Look, when you look into the mirror, Richard, what do you see? Walter, listen. What do you think you see yourself? No. What you see is matter. Nothing more. It's not you. It's completely replaceable. Interesting. What? I mean, he's right that, and wrong. He's right. People. Well, you could be right. But and you know what? I will get out of here. Very soon, in fact. That's good. Very good. Do you still have that house by the lake? I'd like to come visit you someday. A house? Yeah, but uh, I don't need it anymore. Why not? Where are you going? You you're not planning anything stupid, Walter. Don't worry about me. 
Walter, about Tracy and James. I'm worried. Really worried. They'll be fine. They'll take care of themselves. And you will too. Listen, it's my family we're talking about. Oh, why? You didn't seem to care about them before. Family, friends. I mean, you never had any time for anybody. Look, I'm sure Tracy knows what she's doing. How can you say such a thing? I understand that you're disappointed, but you're portraying me as some sort of monster. These and files. So now will help. Can you even make sense of that mess? They're not important anymore. Okay, but what is all this? It just doesn't look healthy. Anatomical studies, neural networks, chemical formulas, architectural models. What the hell is going on, Walter? Are you writing some crazy diary or what? Maybe. But why? <laughs> What's the meaning of it? I told you, it's not important anymore. You can have it. The whole thing. I don't need it anymore. Well, then... He's definitely going to kill himself. I'm coming back tomorrow, okay? Sure. Of course. No, really. I'm coming. of numerous police bots. The Let me police just talk to, uh, Dave real quick. So, what's Walter up to? Still hates me. And what else is new? Drone gate, Steve. It's all about drone gate, because I won that stupid award. He's got to get out of that stupid hole there. I don't get why Frank isn't doing something about it. Like I was twiddling my thumbs. I was the one getting the whole thing off the ground. Richard, not everything's always about you. Yeah, well, he hates me. Obviously. Okay, so I guess we go back to uh, his hotel or something, or his apartment, wherever he lives, and then uh, go from there. One sec. Or why? Oculus opened up, and I was hearing it in the background. The entire time. Oh wait, is this his? Is Billy? That's his hotel, or his apartment? Huh. I didn't know that. I thought it was further away, but I guess I was thinking of uh, the other place, Adam's apartment. What are you looking at? You seem melancholy, sir. Take care of your own stuff. Let's read the documents. That looks interesting, sir. May I ask who created those records? Walter, my ex-partner. Why are you asking? Those are some complex structures. He is intelligent. He was. Is he dead? I do not have any information about that. I apologize, sir. No, he's not dead. This stuff here made him crazy. Would you like me to help analyze it? I can do it alone. As you wish, sir. I just thought it might be faster. I'll do it alone! Walter was my friend. I understand, sir. Okay, let's look at these now. Have a look at that. At what, sir? And not you. <laughs> There's nobody else here. I know, it's just something people say. You were talking with yourself. Yes, people do that. Lonely people do that. <laughs> exactly. All right. Uh, do we talk what? to him now? Nothing, sir. Nothing at all. 